Perp Nation back at it with another outdoor cooking with Perp and that's what we got. Here's our setup today. I plan on doing some crawfish sandwiches. So I just got some bread from the house, some cocktail sauce from the house. Got some fully cooked bacon already. I could use that for the basket out there for bait. And uh, you know, I got some mango pico from the house. Got an avocado, 25 cents. A little dollar salad from Walmart. I'm gonna put a salad you know, on top of the bread. Got the water boiling. Pretty much the only thing in the water is shrimp and crab boil and some salt and pepper. Water's already boiling. Let's go see what we got. Alright. See a couple. Pull, 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 pull. Oh heck yeah. How much we load? Oh, dang. Got a whole lot more than last time, y'all. Heck yeah. Dang, heck yeah. Got a bunch of them. We got some wild ones. Man, I don't even know how much is in there. Last time, how much did we catch last time? Six? Well, I don't know how much is in here. I'm gonna take these out and count them up, y'all. We got some good sizers in there, too. Oh, look, somebody lost their claw already. <laughs> they ripped their claw off. All right, let me get these out. We'll get this started, bad boys. All right, if I counted right, I think we got 14, y'all. I think that's the most we caught so far in that DIY basket I made. Let's check them out. Yeah, buddies, I know y'all went out this cup. The trusty, dusty holder pop cup. Oh, that's a good sizer. Not that biggest, but it will do. That's two, three. Four, five, six, <laughs> this one, seven. I checked them just to make sure they didn't have eggs. Seven, eight, nine, hot, ten. Oh, here's a good sizer. 11. Good sizer. Oh, we got a fighter. Oh, up, 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 up. What is that? 13, 12. I'm not sure what number I'm on now. 12. Yeah, I think that's 12. Uh -huh, 13. And last but not least. Why is the last one always going to put up a bike? Ooh, he's trying to pinch me. Another good sizer. All right, boom. All right, we'll sit there and let that boil up. And we'll be ready for some sandwiches here soon. Like I said, that concentrated stuff is strong. You can smell it a mile away. <laughs> All right, check back with y'all. All right, they're boiling pretty good. Already turning that lobster red. Or should I say Ch Chico shirt red? Chico, say what's up, Tube? What's up, too? <laughs> Ain't paying attention. But yeah, I'll check back with y'all. All right, it's been about 15 minutes. They're looking pretty good. Pretty much you can tell is the back right there starts spreading open, starts seeing more white meat. It's crazy because some of them are more red. You can tell those right there probably just shed not too long ago. Those were probably all the big ones. So they shed it so they look more red than the other ones. But I'll check back with y'all when it's ready. All right, they're finally ready, y'all. So let me, let's get them out. Start making a sandwich here soon. All right, let's peel one of these bad boys. Start with him, good sizer. So you just want to give that little tail a little twist, a little twist off, with the little shell around it. That's actually a good amount of meat on this one. That. Now there's a little bloodline or poop line or whatever that is, like a shrimp on it. You could eat it if you want. I'm not, <laughs> but there it is. That's actually a good sized piece of meat. So let me see here and peel the rest of these. I know you don't want to watch that whole scenery. That could take 20 minutes. All right, after all that peeling, that's the meat we got. Got a good set, good pieces up in here. Some of them are some juicy ones. Chico's over here smelling. You want some, Chico? 
You want some? <laughs> All right, so let me set y'all down. Actually, by the time y'all come back, it should be plated already, so let's go. There it is, y'all. Crawfish sandwich with bacon, avocado, dollar, Walmart dollar fucking salad, I think it was. I think it was a buck. But yeah, it was like a 98 cents. But just think, about an hour and a half ago, they was down there. Caught more this time, too. Kind of figured I left it down there a little bit longer than last time. And I used bacon, so it actually attracted them more. So like I said, if y'all made it this far, don't forget to hit that like button. See you guys on the next journey. Peace, Bird Nation.